Hey everyone, Shin Virtuality here, and today uh, we'll take a little bit of a, a breather, a little bit of a break, and spend some quality time, my quality time, in my time in Portia. Porta? Portia? I don't know. <laughs> However you say it. Port IA. Um, sort of like a uh, more of a relaxing farming building type simulator, more akin to, um, I guess, Stardew Valley, uh, except without all those, you know, 16-bit uh, retro gaming aesthetics to get in the way. Uh, but, you know, uh, I got this not too long ago. It uh, recently had came out for, came out for Android. Uh, and I decided to sort of dip my toe in its water. It is a premium game, so there is no free-to-play option. If you're going to get into it, you're going to have to uh, pay the seven or eight bucks that they want for it. But I figure it's fine. It's probably well worth the spending of the, uh, the cost of the game, especially if it's going to provide hours and hours and hours of non-stop relaxing building action. Uh, so I've created a character not too long ago, but I didn't get too heavily into it. So we're going to start anew and we'll check things out and we'll see how it goes. I think I'll go talk with the research center first. They might think of something. Uh, and of course you have your own little character creator here. Um, my main game I played as a fella, but Let's see what the lady options have to give. They might think of something. And of course, the most the most dire option I'm given at the start is what do I want my voice to sound like? And you got three options. I think I'll go talk with the research center first. They might think of something. Yes, they might think of something. Oh, nah. I think I'll go talk with the research center first. They might think of something. This house. So warm. I need to fix it or I won't be getting a good night's sleep. <laughs> I'm a British, British, but uh, yeah, I think with the with the guys, it came down to voice one or voice three as well. I think I like voice three. So warm. I need to fix it or I won't be getting a good night's sleep. Yeah. All right, we'll stick with that. And then, of course, you have the rest of the creator options. So I'll shoot those through those quickly, and we'll get into the game proper. Set off for adventure. We're coming up on Porsche. Porsche. Oh, that looks beautiful. What are you gonna do there? Ruin diving? Yeah, whatevs. Something like that. <laughs> you get someone like you once in a while. Always seeking that adventure. Good to be young. Too bad you had to co come to a dump like this. Hey, boat safety there. Just jump off in the middle of docking. Jeez. Okay, I'm done. Can I go home now? Just kidding. We haven't even gotten started yet. Hi. Uh, hello? Meet Paisley. And of course, it's been so long that my controller turned off. Yeah. Presley, how do you do? I guess.
Yes, I know him. Ah, good to see you again. Hope you had a pleasant journey from Barnarok, right? Yeah. That's quite far. That's right. Barnarok, born and raised. Yeah. Anyway, I'm here to show you to your workshop, so if you would please follow me, it's pretty close. Oh, better be. working there since your pa left Porsche so many years ago. He was a good friend. It sounds like pa has some uh, some commitment issues. First he left me, then he left here. Like, where's yeah. he going? Yeah. And of course you get your basic tutorials. But, you know what? I'm not new to the game but I'm a I'm a gamer I can I can wing it because we just need to follow follow Paisley no. I'm faster than you Paisley and here we are your workshop what a hunk of junk this place sure has seen some wear and tear what do you think looks homely well, that's one way to put it. Now then, here's a letter from your father. He asked me to present it to you when you've seen this house. <laughs> it says, good luck, sucker! V-Man, when you read this letter, I will already be on the other side of the world. I'm sorry about that. I'm sorry that I'm not the father you wanted me to be. I'm such a shame. This was all so sudden. So I didn't have much time to tell you or figure out how to take care of you. Then I thought about this workshop. It might not look like much now, but it will shelter you from the wind and cover you from the rain. I have left my workshop handbook that details how I created things in my workshop. The rest is up to you. Do your best and live a wonderful life. You'll always be my pride and joy even though I was never around. And now I'm leaving you with this place to fend for yourself. I'm such an irresponsible person. Anyways, your paw. Day one, month one, year one. Oh, it's the beginning of time! Here's the workshop handbook of your paws. Take your time. Come to the Porsche Commerce Guild tomorrow. It's located around Peach Plaza. Can't miss it. I can't miss it? All right, tests. Okay, I'm pretty tired from that initial cutscene and all. Thanks for nothing. Oh, actually, you did give me that letter. I won't be too harsh on you. Day two, month one, year one. Maybe I'll create fire, or maybe invent the wheel. And here we start our new adventure. Any day now. Oh, here we go. Through the cracks. Uh, okay, main UI tutorial. Skip! Alright, so now that we actually have control, I can fix this gap, but I need three wood. I need some wood to fix the gap. Uh, okay, so a little space to call your own. We got here home panel. This is a smart home. <laughs> Furniture has not been placed in your home. My home's health is zero, and its stamina is zero, and its attack is zero, and its defense is zero. My home is not doing very well. It is not ready for an adventure. Uh, all right, well, all sorts of stuff that you can configure your home with once you get it up and running. 
Meet Priestley. <laughs> Just looking at the left there. Meet Presley Presley. Zero of one. All right, well, let's exit. Some more tutorial stuff as you get used to how things are going here. Thank you, Gate. Ah, I have some mail. I guess I better get the mail. Uh, can I get that? There we go. From Porsche Times. Hello, new subscriber. This is Porsche Times. We are sponsored by the city government and the local Commerce Guild branch to bring you the latest news of the city for free. We are, we are a monthly publication, so papers will be sent out on the first of every month of each month. Uh, if you have any questions or concerns, please do not hesitate to visit our office on Main Street, Porsche Times. There's only one street in Porsche, and it's called Main Street. Actually, it's called West Street, so that's what confuses everyone. Uh, from the Commerce Guild. Ah, get some freebies. Builder, we dropped off a few items for you. Be sure to check them out. These gifts are part of our opening celebratory on Facebook and group and all sorts of stuff. Uh, yes. So, the game's giving you some free stuff. That's nice. And we'll try them out in a minute. And we dropped off a few items. A welcome gift pack to make sure to check them out. These gifts are part of opening a celebratory Facebook. Stuff. What is this Facebook I keep hearing about? Uh, okay, awesome. Speaking of Facebook, if you want to follow me on Facebook, you'll find my page, Shin Virtuality, on Facebook. Hello, Builder. Uh, don't you know my name? Level 1 to X1. Uh, Alright, whatever. Uh, Porsche Community has granted your wish. Here's a bubble wand to help you through the summer heat. Yay. Okay. Perfect. Um, what is this? Oh, something I don't need. You know what? Yeah, can I not? There's someone running at me. Who are you? Who are you? He was spy for the Dubos Empire. Huh? Uh, suspicious. Hey, you're the one who's suspicious here. Wearing your Hulu t-shirt and your blue cap. <laughs> spar? <laughs> we can spar with other people? Alright, well you go on your way. Oh, what we got here? I'll just open this chest and take stuff. One gloves. Alright, we'll do that. Ah, uh, yes, got some shiny stuff here. So, as you start off in the world, start gathering up stuff to... Because you'll be building eventually, so best to get the easy stuff first, and then you can start working on the uh, more important stuff later. Uh, but let's see, can we get into the options here? All right. So, we have some stuff. Can I... Come on. There we go. I'm just gonna... I'll start with the summer top. Uh, there's also some stuff. I think the gloves are for fighting, so... Put them in there, and we'll need to make some tools. Uh, I won't skip ahead, uh, because I think that's what we're going to be meeting previously with first. So let's do that now. Here's another fellow, Lee. This must be the new builder in the mirror. The Church of Light, eh? Uh, you can gift RPS or leave. So let's leave. Hi there. Who are you? Oh, a missionary from the Church of Light. 
heard about this church of yours. Again, same options. We won't get too much into character interaction now. We need to, uh, we've got Mars and Russo. We'll meet the, um, the people of Portia in good time. So let's head to the Commerce Guild. Let's say well. Good, good. Let me introduce you to the Commerce Guild. This is the Commerce Guild. We're the organization that orchestrates trade across the entire Free Cities region. This is the Porsche branch. We're pretty busy throughout the year. Mm, you don't say. Now then, let me give you your builder test. This is pretty easy. Take an axe and pickaxe and bring them to me. You will need to have wood and stones to make these. You can gather them on your own or buy them from the total tools in Central Square. Buy? You think I am, Miss Moneybags here? After you have the raw materials, you need to craft the items on a work table. I saw your parcel run in your yard, so check and see if that still works. Why he wasn't a very good builder. He built in the yard and not in the actual workshop. Yeah, so you get a work table and in order to build stuff. Hi there. I know who you are. I'm Antoine. We'll probably be seeing each other a lot. <laughs> uh, okay. Hi, Anton. It's... Oh, it takes stamina. All right. Uh, choices, choices, choices. Paper. Aha. I win. Uh, rock. Oh. He's not going to do that twice, is he? Ha ha. And finish him with scissors. Yeah. No, I, I trounced you at RPS, so that's all I needed to do. All right, now that we're back in the world, let's go and see if we can't, uh, currently unavailable. Okay, so that's a jump button. Is that, oh. I'm, I'm fighting. I'm not fighting very well. Uh, okay, so let's quickly gather the stuff that we need. I don't think we need a lot of it, but, uh. I want to go back to the workbench and find that I am lacking in either the stone or wood departments. Gather, gather, gather. Hello, Mr. Scarecrow. Let's go see you. Can I gather you? I'm going to say no. And yump. All right. Let's see what we can do here. Work table. All right. So simple axe. Make it. Make it, I say. <sighs> what am I missing? I'm missing a stone. Have to go back out and get one of these. You know what? One was always never enough. All right. That should just about do it. What are we looking at? We're looking at noontime, so we're making good time here. Uh, pickaxe. Craft. Confirm. And then those items are now down on my toolbar, as you can see on the bottom of the screen. So if I select a pickaxe... Who are you? Toady! Hey, I'm Toady. You're the new builder, right? It's always nice to have more builders. Met Toby. I guess you get uh, 
Get points for meeting everyone. <laughs> Never get use of that spar function. <laughs> hey, I just met you. Let's fight. No, nah, let's not. I am new to this world. I do not want to, you know, start off in a bad impression. There we go. Oh! Hit rock. I'll just go over here because I think... Uh... Oh, I can mine this. Okay. There will be sizable stuff. Oh, level up! Oh, no, I need a bigger, pick, better pickaxe. So, yeah, that's sort of the thing. So let's get some wood. Doing actual trees and rocks will get you more items. Like, I guess you get this tree sap. But it will net some better wood wood numbers than what you would get otherwise. Uh, you can also gather this. Herbs. You know, green herbs, like Resident Evil. I'm just lay waste to everything. The city doesn't need this, does it? Alright. Well, before we go meet... Presley again. Uh, let's go into our character. All right, because we do have some, we do have some XP uh, experience gained by. Uh, that's the fighting tree. So you, everything's sort of built into these three trees: uh, social, gather, and fighting. But we're starting off with. Starting off with the gather, so it may be beneficial, and I'm a little bit of a newbie here, so I'm going to say we're going to get out the, the gather stuff first, because I think it's going gonna, it's gonna to pay off. Uh, Standing on decrease. Okay, so as we're gathering stuff, we'll use less energy doing so, which is always nice. We'll just unequip everything. Okay, let's head back to the Commerce Guild. Hello, Elbert. So lots of people in the city to find and meet and interact with. And I think our energy is getting a little low. Yeah, we're at 35 energy. Hey, Presley! Presley! Ah, excellent quality! Nicely done. You can keep them. I just wanted to see what you can do. Now for the second test, you want to build a stone furnace. This one's a bit tougher. You need to use the assembly station in your yard to complete this task. Aw, harder! I don't like harder! Hmm. If I remember correctly, your pa kept a very detailed account of the things he made. You might want to flip through his workshop handbook and see if you can find a diagram for the stone furnace. Once you have a diagram, just use it on the assembly station in your yard to start construction. All right, so that is the assembly table, I guess. Yay, I passed Paisley's first test. So, now that we're tasked with making a stone furnace, I guess we should gather more stone. Let's see if we can knock this out before the day is done. Here's a stone, can I get it? Yep. Another stone. Mine for the taking. If I could hit it. Uh, similar to Stardew Valley, you'll uh, lose stamina as you go through your stuff. Uh, okay, uh, so here's his workbook, I guess. <laughs> Blank pages. Ah! I don't know what to do! Duh! Uh, no, just kidding. Alright, so some sort of minor setup stuff at the beginning, and then you get into recipes. 
Um, <laughs> I play my other game. I clicked on something I didn't want to build and it took me like an hour to get rid of it so I can get the stone furnace going. But you have a fair bit of stuff that you can DD transport. Oh, making us some vehicles later. Uh, but let's get back. We wanted the stone furnace. So on the left hand side, you have stone furnace. The right hand side is grinder. So I want to build the stone furnace. Uh, and then all you need to do is add the materials to the place. Let's take a look at the assembly instructions again. Uh, so we need a stone stool and some wood. And I think you can create the stone stool here. So let's see if we can do that. Stone stool. There we go. I knew it. Uh, and when we're here, do we want to prep the sword? Not enough materials. Oh, I need a hardwood. All right. We haven't started getting hardwood yet, so getting a hardwood is hard. Uh, okay, yeah, looks like everything's there, so take that and take that. I'm sort of using a, a mixture of the, uh, um, I guess, the gamepad and the screen. Still haven't gotten the full control layout out of it yet, but... Uh, okay, did that thing just drop into my... It did not. So, let's go into our inventory. Ah, I do. I just couldn't find it. There we go. Let's... And you can sort of place wherever these things are going to go. Uh, rotate... Put down. Boom! Stone furnace. And it is now 18.30. Uh, it's 6 o'clock. I don't think we'll have time to talk to Paisley again. So let's enter our house. We should have some leftover wood. Uh, and let's see if we can start fixing gaps. Uh, yes. I am a builder after all. All right, this is a small one. Ten wood. We have enough for that too. That's going to be a big one. And Twenty wood. Nope, we don't have it. How about this one? Three wood. All right, so... 20 wood to fix that, and then everything should be good to go. Uh, let's let's give ourselves somewhere to sit, since we have this stuff. Sand rock box. Uh, do I know what these things are? Uh, get it random item. Okay, let's see what we get. Ah, oh, lamp. Let's use it again. Ah, oh, shades. Punk glasses. Bone mat. Okay. Uh, okay, so shades. Why not? Yeah, now we look cool. Uh, do 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 do. Uh, let's. Uh, bone mat. Uh, we'll put the bone mat. Where are we going to put the bone mat? Where do we want to put the bone mat? We'll put it right in front of the door. Why not? Uh, and what else do we got? We got this guy. That's pretty big for a lamp. But let's go to sleep. Apparently, I like sleeping in till the middle of the day. Could do with a little bit more get up and go. Oh, my head hurts. I didn't sleep well at all from all the breeze coming through the cracks. I'm getting to it. 
<laughs> there. I will ease my muscles on this massage chair. Now, let's get going. do I'm gonna gather some wood to fix that last crack I want to make sure we sort of get that done before the day's end so chop chop and another point to put into something here what we'll do is we'll start get the mastery of pickaxe and make sure that uh, stamina doesn't uh, go down too quickly as I'm doing that too. Uh, and I believe the rocks and foliage that I'm getting rid of here will replenish over time. And if not, well, we'll just have to find somewhere else to get all our stuff from. Ooh, I got mail! From Town Hall. Hello, new builder. Name unidentified. We'd like to remind you that Porsche currently has two authorized ruins for you to dive in. First abandoned ruin site below the Church of Light, and a hazardous ruin in the collapsed wasteland east of town. For your own safety, all other ruins are currently off limits, because you're just too noobish. Thank you, Porsche Town Hall. Uh, well, that's nice. Resource box. Okay, I'm gonna actually put stuff into that and maybe get paid for it, but I'm still getting used to things, how things are working. So, let's see if we can fix this gap. Yes! No thanks to Pa, leaving it even this place in such disarray, disrepair. Okay, we got our stone furnace. Let's see if we need to talk to Priestley again. Is that another chest up there? Did I discover a chest? I did discover a chest. How do I get up there? Oh, I just jump. Okay, open. Give me your goodies. Bloodstone. I have a blood pack with this bloodstone. All right. Oh, hi, Antoine. You be you keep being you. Where's Presley? I guess I should actually follow the marker. Okay, he's over here. There he is. Hey, you know what? Work started an hour ago. Great job. You pass. I know. I'm just that good. This is your builder license. <laughs> now I'm a licensed builder? I guess I was just... Uh, Breaking the law before. Oh, what is going on with those horses? <laughs> oh, is that all? Okay. Well, I guess I gotta go to the mayor's office now. Gotta do things by the book. There. Finally find your seat, Gail. <laughs> nice to see our mares not uh, fitting into their seats well.
the workshop. The name of my workshop is Workshop. Yes. <laughs> workshop, workshop. Nice, nice imaginative name there. Uh, registration is complete. Yay. No, I just arrived like two days ago. I thought you were the mayor. You should know this stuff. Ah, okay. Well, registered is done. Let's talk with. No, oh, I guess I got an in-game achievement. I am a builder now. Hello, Arlo. Civil core. <laughs> no funny business, you clowns. Got it. How about we fight on it? Nah. Let's get back to the Commerce Guild. Hello! He would. He amounted to anything in his life. On the board over where? To your left? Well, my left, your right. Oh, so I'm in competition with everybody else, apparently. I'm not the only builder in town. I think we just ascertained that. Five workshops? Jeez. Once you're done with your orders, you can pick up the commission fee from Antoine if it's from the guild or the respected person who commissioned you. Builders make most of their money from doing commissions through the Commerce Guild. But some just build items and sell directly to the market. That's fairly lucrative as well. So, cha-ching then? Anyway, since this is your first commission, I've kept one just for you. Swipe. Playing favorites, are we? Chicken, you already took one today. There are never too many commissions. Good day. That runt. He's the owner of the current's number one workshop. Brilliant businessman, but I don't like the way he does things. Well, I'm sorry. That was our last one today. Hey, Prez. I've got a job for you. Or not. Hey, Prez. What is it, Arlo? Yeah, what is it? We're looking to build a bridge to Amber Island. Amber has her own island? So the mayor finally put up the money? Well, young builder here is up for the challenge. Say my name. <laughs> it says right there in the text, young V-man, not young builder. Haunted Cave? Sign me up! Check your Pa's workshop handbook to see if he has a bridge diagram in there. I remember he built a bunch. If it's there, use it at your assembly station. After you're done with the bridge pieces, you'll need to go to the designated spot and assemble the bridge. <laughs> so, so Pa had a bunch of bridge... He built a bunch of bridges so he can escape this, <laughs> this town? Yeah, so Temple Tower, got it. 
All right, see you guys. All right, well, this was where I sort of got to in my first game, but I did want to try and check out some of the ruin stuff. So I guess the first thing we should do, make sure we have enough inventory space because uh, if we are, are gathering materials for building bridges, uh, then we'll need to make sure we uh, collect them all and bring them back to our workshop. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, bridge, um, okay, so it's just telling us we need to build a bridge. Not really giving us any direction of where to find the ruins, although we do know that one of them is under the Temple of Light. So then the question is, where is the Temple of Light? It, we got, oh, abandoned ruin. All right. Hey there. First time ruin diving? Uh, hey there, Remington. Uh, yep. Yep. All righty. Let me explain then. All the ruins in the Alliance of Free Cities are regulated by the Civil Corps. To enter the ruins, you'll need to pay a weekly maintenance fee, but we'll give you a 60% discount the first time. When you enter, I'll give you the jetpack and scanner. Very handy ancient relics. Mining for resources becomes a lot easier when you have these equipped. When you come out, we'll need them back, since they're very rare. This one beside me is an abandoned ruin. No monsters or robots in there, just resources and relics like power stones. Anything you find in the ruins are yours to keep. Unless they're ancient weapons. Then we're supposed to hand them over to the church for destruction. Okay, I'm done. Have fun and be safe in there. Okay, I'm done. Where are you going? All right, there. Bye. Uh, let's go to Rambanded Ruins. 80 goals. Do we have 80 goals? I guess we do. Achieve <gasps> and unlocked. I'm apparently a ruin diver. Okay, well, got rid of my punk shades for these goggles, which I guess I'm not complaining. Uh, all right, what do we need to do? Oh, I see. Makes you jump higher. Got it. Uh, so, now that I'm in the ruin. Oh, I see. Okay. I just whack at walls here? Oh, is that just dirt? Uh, stone. I haven't noticed any wear and tear on my tools, so at least that's a good sign. I, you know, I know that games usually have, like, stuff like wear and tear on tools just so that, you know, not overusing them, but I kind of like the just having at it and, and you know, just doing your own thing. Tin ore, copper ore. Uh, I don't even know what I need. So you know what? Since copper is the one thing that I don't necessarily have, let's see if I can just get a bunch of it. And, of course, eventually I'm going to run out of stamina. Sand. I need sand. Sand would make glass, right? Oh, is there something else? Oh, a new room. Okay. Didn't know we would get new rooms. Uh, let's see what's up here. Anything of interest? There's probably more copper. Is this just stone? It is. Oh, what the? Mentioning something about... Uh, Remington man said something that I can't take stuff, so...
here you can just dig tunnels. Uh, okay. Are the tunnels that I make persistent? Like, if I leave and come back, do I still have all the 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 deformation that I have uh, created, or can I start anew? Let's make let's make our hole bigger. It's good that I can just aim at stuff, and then it'll just work. Can I aim at the? There we go. Nice big hole. Uh, I don't... I'm getting a lot of copper, which, you know, is probably good in the long run. <laughs> Level up. And sorry for my air conditioner, it's probably creating a little bit of background noise that shouldn't be there, so I'll try and plan this out for when I uh, <laughs> record videos in the future. Uh, I was not expecting that for today's game. Okay, yeah, it's getting late, and I'm probably running out of stamina anyway, so let's say we've done what we can for this particular ruin. Let's exit. I don't know if this would have the same mechanic as Stardew Valley. If you are late to get home, you suffer by not getting a good night's sleep or, you know, just not getting the full stamina that you need. Ah, workshop! Just like I named it. Come on, up and at him. Let's go. Bridge isn't going to make itself. Uh, first things first. We got another skill point. And... And then our resources. We haven't really started the herbs yet. You know what? I'm going to take smooth talk. I have a feeling that uh, getting relationships will be part of the part of what we need to do. Oh, it's raining. Uh, okay, assembly station. So we need to build a bridge. Ah, so we do need copper. All right. And hardwood. Cut with a civil cutter. So what, we need a civil cutter to cut hardwood before we even... Uh, this is going to be... Uh, so where's... Oh, there's our civil cutter. Stone equals stone bricks. Uh, I need... Copper to get copper bars to get copper blades. So I have a feeling that this is going to be our first project. <laughs> and I don't have either of the things that it needs. Uh, you know what? That's probably why we made this stone furnace. Uh, so stone brick. I need five of these. Can I make five of these? Fuel depleted. Uh, yeah, we'll give it half. Give it ten wood. Uh, can I craft? Oh, I don't want max. Twelve hours and thirty minutes. I don't know if that better be in-game time. You know what? Let's make two for now. No, I don't want to cancel. So, 
Okay, all right, yeah, this is in-game time. Phew! Uh, I guess I could make myself another stone furnace if I needed to. Ah. Uh. Uh, I guess we can... Just taking a look at some of the other stuff here. Yeah, silver cutter seems to be the thing that we need, so... For now, let's make ourselves... A wooden storage. Because those will be handy. More mail. Uh, just want to inform you that's a core in Portia can take some commissions from you if you're when it comes to gathering materials uh, from hazardous rooms. You can post a commission on our commission boards. You can commission for your commission, basically, is what they're saying here. Uh, hey builder, please use my name. Uh, at the end of the week, we need qualified people to inspect these products. What name? This we will not post any commissions during the weekend, but feel free to turn in. Okay. Uh, I have a manly commission for you. We help you get settled in. If you're feeling it, I need three copper blades for my. For some of my furniture. Also a knee. I also expect nothing but macho quality. <laughs> awesome. Sure, I'll accept. I don't think I'll be able to make it in this particular video, but you never know. Uh, gather. I will need to make more... Uh, can I... Can I remove? Uh, confirm. I haven't done anything with it yet. So that's how you can cancel. Uh, just a little cutter. Need old parts. You know what? Let's build another stone furnace, because we're probably going to need it. Right. Needed the wood. There we go. Retrieve it. Two hours and thirty minutes to make one copper bar. Oh man, this is gonna take forever. But you can sort of see where this is gonna go. I have one stone brick. Ah, uh, all right. So, 
Back to here, our civil cutter, which we need in order to cut stuff for our bridge. Any hardwood planks. And again, I need to, oh, the bronze plate for the wooden bridge body. Smelt with a furnace. Okay, that's not all bad. So yeah, you need various other tools to make the components that you need in order to get this done. Ah, so you can sort of see how how deep you can get in here um, with all the building stuff. Which, you know what, if that's what you're looking for, then all the more power to you. So, yeah, let's... We're going to have to start with our civil cutter here. But considering that these things do take some time to build, um, we are probably not going to get to see the end of our bridge construction before the end of this quick play, which has probably gone on a little bit longer than it should have. So maybe we'll just cut it here and say if you like what you see from my time at Porsche, then by all means, check it out in the app stores and see if it's worth um, the premium price they're asking for and give it a shot for yourself. Like I said, if you just want sort of a more of a low-key type of game, uh, this may be it. If you are enjoying my videos of various mobile games, then drop me a like in the video. Uh, it certainly helps me out when, uh, when creating and uh, it, uh, it goes a long way, trust me. Uh, if you want to see more of my time at Porsche or other mobile games, then drop me a comment. And subscribe to my channel for more mobile gaming goodness. Um, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel for free, and I'll try and post at least a video a week just to sort of, you know, check new things out. Uh, I also am thinking of quick playing some older games. There are some definitely good games, uh, notable good mobile games uh, previously. Um, but yeah, subscribe to my channel because you'll never know what I'll be picking up next. This has been Shin Virtuality. Game on, have fun, and we'll catch you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye now.